Welcome to this video. In this video, we will learn about Chandra Jayanti, the birthday of moon deity. We will find out who are the people who need to do remedies for the moon. Finally, we will learn about the moon mantras and the moon remedies which can be used on Chandra Jayanti. So, please watch the full video. If you are not subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe to the channel by pressing the subscribe button and the bell button below. In astrology, the most important planet is Moon. That's because Moon represents the human mind. In any birth chart, the Moon's position determines a person's character. Whenever a person is born, his or her character is determined by the zodiac sign and the constellation of the Moon in which it's passing through. The human character is further shaped up by the planets which aspect the Moon or conjunct with it. This is the reason why Vedic Astrology gives most importance to moon sign. If your moon in your birth chart is very strong, you will feel happy and relaxed even though you may be plagued by many problems. On the other hand, if your moon is very weak in your birth chart, you can never feel happy even though you may be the most wealthiest person holding much power. So. The moon's position in your birth chart will determine whether you are capable of feeling happy with whatever you got. So, if you feel unhappy or depressed, you definitely need to do remedy for the moon. If the moon in your birth chart is afflicted, you have to do remedy for the moon. If the moon in your birth chart is placed in bad houses like 6th house, 8th house and 12th house, then you have to do remedy for the moon. If the moon in your birth chart is in waning phase, then your moon becomes a natural malefic and you have to do remedy. If the moon in your birth chart is in growing phase and becomes a lot of Kendra houses like 4th house, 7th house and 10th house, then you have to do remedy because moon gets Kendra Dipadi Dosh. If the moon in your birth chart is a lot of 3rd house, 6th house or 11th house from moon sign or ascendant, then the effect of moon will be unfavorable. For people born in Scorpio Moon Sign and Scorpio Ascendant, the effect of Moon will be unfavorable. This means that those people whose Moon Signs or Ascendants fall in Taurus, Virgo, Scorpio and Aquarius should definitely do remedies for the Moon. If you want to do remedy for the Moon, the best day will be on Chandra Jayanti, the birthday of Moon Deity. Now, there are two different versions about the birthday of Moon Deity. In South India, it is widely believed that Moon was born on Krithika Nakshatra of solar month of Scorpio. At the same time, there is another belief that Moon was born on Shukla Paksha Ashtami in solar month of Scorpio. So, you can choose whichever day you like as per your belief system. From my own experience, I found that the best remedy for any planet is to pray to the controlling deity and the super controlling deity meaning Devata and Adi Devata of any planet. According to the Vedas, the controlling deity of Moon is Varuna and the super controlling deity is Goddess Parvati. Most of you will be knowing that it was Lord Shiva who saved Moon from many curses. So, the most effective remedy for Moon is to visit Shiva temples on every Monday and pray to Lord Shiva and Goddess Parvati. On every Monday, you should start with a prayer to Lord Ganapati and then pray to Lord Shiva and Goddess Parvati. Whenever you visit Shiva temple, you can offer milk and curd to Lord Shiva and Parvati for Abhishekam. You can also offer milk to devotees in Shiva temples. If you are unable to visit any Shiva temple, 
you can offer water to plants trees animals and birds as you know moon is the only celestial thing which you can see with your eyes easily you can also pray to the moon while looking at it directly while praying to the moon you can chant moon mantras the best mantra for moon remedy is the gayatri mantra of moon now i will tell you the gayatri mantra of moon please listen carefully om padmat dwajaya vidmahe hem rupaye timahi tanno soma prachodayat if you are unable to learn the gayatri mantra of moon you can chant another easy mantra the easiest mantra of moon is om klim somaya namaha i am repeating again om klim somaya namaha the best day to appease moon is on chandra jayanti if you miss chandra jayanti please do these remedies on every monday if you really like this video please press the like button below whenever you like my videos it encourages me to share more and more information so don't forget to press the like button below if you have any doubts or opinions please comment below if you are not subscribed to the channel yet please subscribe to the channel by pressing the subscribe button and the bell button below